I urge you to read the order, which is available on the FCC website and on ours. <clears throat> the court remanded the issue back to the FCC for reasoned decision making. This is an agency that has operated above the law for decades with a revolving door of leaders that come from and go back to the telecom industry they're supposed to regulate. Harvard University in 2014 published a report concluding that the FCC was a captured agency unable to exercise appropriate independent authority, specifically saying that the wireless industry was using tactics of big tobacco, attacking scientists and funding sources. As I wrote about in my book, Disconnect, the wireless industry has wargamed the science for several decades. It ignored, for example, the evidence from the Department of Interior Fish and Wildlife Service, urging it to consider effects on wildlife and the environment. It ignored extensive evidence showing that radio frequency radiation can affect pregnancy outcomes, such as the research we will hear about from Professor Hugh Taylor of Yale University that found damaged memory and hyperactivity in animals exposed prenatally. <clears throat> Astonishingly, the FCC also ignored and dismissed the findings of the National Toxicology Program. What makes this astonishing is that the FDA had ordered this study from the National Toxicology Program, had reviewed the study design throughout the history of the study, had approved and evaluated the data, and then when the results came out showing clear evidence of cancer, DNA damage, heart damage in animals, the FDA decided that the study they had ordered and designed was somehow not relevant. This means that all of the animal testing that we do to develop drugs and vaccines, as well as other things, would be invalid if you said they're not relevant to humans. I wonder whether the FDA was thinking that animals should be making phone calls to make a relevant study here. The fact of the matter is the protocol used by the NTP in their $30 million study was the best that could be done and is relevant to humans as many other scientists have written as you can find on our website as and published in the peer reviewed literature.